Hey everyone, welcome to Imagination Storytime. I'm thrilled to have you on my special journey today. Today we're diving into the pages of Families, Families, Families by Suzanne and Max Lang, a heartwarming book that's not just a story but a celebration of love and diversity. What does diversity mean to you and how do you celebrate it in your life? Okay everyone, grab your comfy spot, a warm drink, and let's immerse ourselves in the magic of storytelling. Some children have lots of siblings. Some children have none. Some children have two dads. Some have one mom. Some children live with their grandparents. And some live with an aunt. Some children have many pets. And some just have a plant. Some children live with their father. Some children have two mothers. Some children are adopted. Some have stepsisters and brothers. Some children bunk with their cousins. Some have a mom and a pop. Some children's parents are married. Some children's parents are not. So, no matter if you have a ma, a pa, a hog, this llama, ten frogs and a slug, a cousin named Doug, a great grandma Betty and a great aunt Sue, uncles Hal, Al, and Sal, and uncle Lou, too. One step sis, three step bros, two step moms, and a prize winning rose. A robot butler to serve you tea. The world's biggest grandpa, or whatever it might be. If you love each other, then you are a family. The end. Thank you all for joining me so much in this heartwarming journey through families, families, families. I hope the magic of this story stays with you, reminding us all of the beauty and diversity and the power of love. If you enjoyed this read aloud, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more uplifting moments. Take care, and I'll see you in the next chapter. Bye, everyone.